Hi, I'm Charlie. Welcome to our Sea Life Park video series here on Homemade Adventures. We are going to take you with us as we get up close and personal with a fantastic array of marine life and make amazing discoveries about the inhabitants of our aquatic world. Join us and watch the performances, it'll feel like you're wading right in with the wildlife. Sea Life Park was also featured in the hit movie by Adam Sandler, 50 First Dates. Our trip starts walking through the entrance, going through the shark's cave, which you've seen in our other video, all the way over to the sea lion exhibit, just past the Rocky Shores sign. And the first thing we're going to do is watch a sea lion painting. Guess correctly what she has painted, then you'll be able to take her masterpiece home with you. Sound good? All right, well now that Leona has all of her art supplies, let's get started. Now while Leona is working on her painting, did you all know that she represents one of six different species of sea lions that can be found around the world? Sea Life Park is home to California sea lions. This particular species can be found along the western coast of North America, ranging from British Columbia, Canada, all the way down to Baja, Mexico. California sea lions are marine mammals, which means they do need to come up to the surface to breathe air. However, underwater, sea lions can hold their breath anywhere from 30 seconds all the way up to 15 minutes. And using their very long front flippers, sea lions can achieve swimming speeds of up to 13 miles per hour. Not only are they faster than their, their seal cousins, who typically top out around 10 miles per hour, but they are also four times faster than the average human, even Michael Phelps himself. All right, class, well, it looks like Leona Kai has just finished her artwork. What do you say, class? That's a beautiful painting, right? Yeah. Now, as promised, if anyone out there thinks they know what Leona has painted, please raise your hands nice and high in the air. All right, let's see here. How about towards the front in the blue tank top and black shorts? What's your guess, bud? Nice and loud. Flamingo? A camel flamingo, like a hybrid animal? Okay, let's ask her. Leona, is it a camel flamingo? She says yes, it is a camel flamingo! My goodness, Leona Kai, your creativity just astounds me. You are creating new animals here. All right, bud, you can meet one of our trainers at the end of the show at the gate right down there to pick up your sea lion painting. If you like this video, be sure to hit the subscribe button and click the bell to be notified when we upload new adventures. You also get to learn a lot about the sea lions by watching them play with the trainers while using cues. The trainers were lovely. It was perfect to see the park on a weekday. It wasn't overcrowded. They have different feeding and entertainment shows virtually every 30 to 45 minutes, so your day fills up pretty easily. Did you know that sea lions, along with other seals and the walrus, belong to the family called pennypeds? Pennyped means fin or flipper footed. Although commonly confused for one another, there are many differences between seals and sea lions. Sea lions have large fore or front flippers that when on land they can use them to push themselves up and off the ground. Seals on the other hand have a short thinly webbed fore flippers that cannot support their body weight and hind flippers that point away from their bodies and do not have the ability to rotate. All pennypeds are mammals. There are five mammal characteristics. They breathe air, they have hair slash fur, they're warm blooded, they give live birth, and they drink milk.
So if you look at a penny pet's nostrils, you'll notice that it's an opposite of a human nostril. Our nostrils are naturally open, and we don't have the ability to close them. While penny pet's nostrils are naturally closed, and they have to use muscles to open their nostrils in order to breathe. This is because they spend most of their time in the water. The sea lion's entire body is structured for life in the water with a smooth torpedo shaped torso and its flattened, powerful flippers, like four large swim fins instead of feet. In fact, the swim fins scuba divers and backyard snorkelers use were modified after a sea lion's unique compressed and web-toed hind feet. Sea lions live in very large social groups called colonies that may come together and some bathe in masses of the hundreds. Sea lions have thick fur and even thicker layers of blubber to keep them warm in their preferred cold climates. But they do exist in all oceans of the world except for the Atlantic Ocean. Sea Life Park trains their sea lions by using positive reinforcement. The animals at Sea Life Park Hawaii are trained for husbandry, which are medical behaviors that are used to better and ensure that the animals are always in good health. The sea lions here at Sea Life Park, as noted before, are California sea lions, and they are fed fish and squid. The vocalization of all the sea lions are also very different. Sea lions are known to be quite noisy and can even project loud barks. However, seals are known to be much quieter and when they vocalize they use softer grunts like growl like noises. you think of the video let us know your thoughts in the comments section and don't forget to like share and subscribe to homemade adventures for more great videos just like this one there's no place I'd rather be there's no place I'd rather be